Hey everybody, Lamar Dawson here, and I'm wearing pink today because we're celebrating Mean Girls. 15 years ago, the movie debuted in the box office, and a year ago it hit Broadway. I'm here with two stars from the musical, Barrett Wilbert Reed and Gray Henson. Hey. hey. Now the show's been on Broadway. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be That's fun. how we greet people. <laughs> hey. Oh, hi. It's hi. an extended hey. <laughs> so this show has been killing it on Broadway the last year. Thanks. What's the reaction been like? I think it's people awesome. are loving it. Yeah, it's really fun. It's a really fun show to do. Some people treat it like a Rocky Horror type thing where they just come and get loaded and like wait to like scream things out in <laughs> after the i say she doesn't even go here like oh yeah they're on it. deafening applause or sometimes dead silence if we have school groups yeah i don't know some I, it's funny because the movie had such a following like when we were in high school like yeah. all of those people that are in their 20s love it mm -hmm. but there's this really young fan base too that are like grabbing onto the show and not letting it go do you have yeah. any crazy fan moments from like the audience oh yeah like i i once unfortunately <laughs> called somebody out for dancing in the front row because she knew all the choreography. And I think it was like an interview we did last year. I literally was like, we know you've seen the bootleg. And then she tweeted me and was like, it wasn't the bootleg. Like, I'm so I, sorry, I'm so sorry. I loved it and I, I felt so bad because I really, I kind, of, I kind of came for her and I don't tweet at all ever. Right. And so for me to tweet an aggressive tweet to a 15 year old was just was out of the It sort of ruined my career. You took her down. Yeah. <laughs> and Gray never. Forever. <laughs> no, she was so sweet. I mean, uh, sorry, girl. <laughs> Have you met your movie counterparts in real yeah. life? Yes. What's that? Okay, what's that been like? Where was it like, rather? Amazing. Ours are the best. Yeah. The best. They're so cool. Liz was amazing. Just like really a dream, dream situation. She just like came and like showered us in like food-based gifts. Mm -hmm. Did you was, know like, she was so coming? nice and lovely. I knew like very last minute yeah. that she was coming, and I was really excited because I'm a huge fan of her. Like, so talented mm -hmm. in general, and so I was like, wow, 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 I can't believe like we're getting to have this like moment. Did yeah. she give you any advice? No, she was just like, thank you for not screwing this up, and I was like, yeah, I'm <laughs> <So> thank you. <laughs> I'm, glad, I'm glad you're okay with me. It was a big moment in their careers, and yeah, Daniel Franzese. I actually met him before we started rehearsals at DragCon because that's something I would mm. attend on my own, mm -hmm. and he had a whole booth set up. And whole he, booth. Yeah, he was just like greeting fans and signing things as like Damien from the movie. And I went up to him, I was like, I'm playing Damien in the musical. And he like freaked out and we like took a picture and then he came to see the show. And yeah. he's seen it maybe a couple times, yeah. I think. But we keep in touch. He's so sweet. They're yeah, both so they're awesome. They're really nice. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. Now the movie is such a pop culture classic. Everyone quotes it all the time, all the memes, 15 years in it. Yeah. How old were you when the movie came out? I was 15. It was 2004, I was 14. Yeah. Okay. Now, do you have any identification towards the characters, like personally, or did you relate to them? Yeah, I mean, I remember when I saw the movie, I was, it was the first time I saw like a gay teen on TV, or I mean, in the, in the theaters. And I was like, oh, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. And he was so confident and comfortable. And I grew up in a small town in Georgia, so I definitely was not Damien, but like, I wanted to be that person. Mm. So that was a big deal. Yeah. Yeah. I think like, as I've grown up, I identify with different characters in the movie, like depending on like what's going on in my life, because there are so many to choose from. Who are you today? I mean, I think I'm always Janice. I think that's why I'm playing Janice, but I mean <laughs> you like- You are Janice. But you've got yeah. glam vibes. Thank you. Glam Janice. I connect on a deep <laughs> level with Gretchen Wieners. Do you yeah, really? You really do. In what way? I just care too much about what people think about me. Oh, I see. Do you really? Yeah, I'm gonna cry. Oh no. <laughs> Lately on the couch here, feel free to stretch. No, I'm we kidding. can work through this. No, I always I've loved that character always. I think she's so special. And like they really dive deep in the musical and they give her this really heartbreaking ballad about like, oh my god, it's called What's Wrong With mm -hmm. Me. And you're just like, oh damn. What ways is the show different from the from the movie? Oh my god, so many ways. Yeah, we, I mean, sing. The, we sing. We sing number one. Number one. We sing. We tap you dance. dance. Yeah. You dance. Ferret moves a little yeah. bit. Janice and Damien are the narrators <clears throat> of the musical, yeah. which I think because people that come to the theater uh, sort of relate to the art freaks. And mm. so I think totally. that was a really smart choice on their part yeah. to be like, we're going to be sort of them and the way that they see the show through our eyes. Totally. Right. And, and also the other biggest update is that it takes place today. So it's not like a period piece of 2004, you know, totally. high school drama. Right, right. Yeah. They it's thought about, about doing that when they were like adapting the show. They sure. thought about keeping it mm -hmm. in 2004, like literally with like flip right. phones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but everything's um, about social media and about how sure. people tear each other down online. Wow, yeah. yeah. And how that's like, it's a huge part of <clears> growing <throat> up. Yeah. It's being online now. So what's the message you hope people take away from the show when they watch it? Uh, it's like, don't be a dick. We say it at the <laughs> very yeah. end. Yeah. What do we yeah. say? Um, 
But well, even, the, even the people, what are, line, even the people, <laughs> the very end, even I, the people you don't like at all are still people, so get off their dicks. So get mm. off their dicks, yeah. So don't be a dick and see Mean Girls on Broadway. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, what a good, like, Honestly, we'll see you there. Yes. Thanks for joining us. Thanks, Thank you. Of course, us. anytime.